तो हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू एजुकेशन वाइब्स आई एम प्रणय डायरेक्टर ऑफ एजुकेशन वाइब्स सो आर्ट रोम इज विथ अस द रिप्रेजेंटेटिव ऑफ ओम स्टेट मेडिकल यूनिवर्सिटी ही इज इन इंडिया राइट नाउ ही इज विजिटिंग आवर ऑफिसेस ऑन डेली बेसिस ही इज विजिटिंग आवर सेमिनार्स एंड ही इज सीन वी आर रिक्रूटिंग टू स्टूडेंट्स फॉर ओम स्टेट मेडिकल यूनिवर्सिटी फॉर द एम बी कोर्स and the education vibes is the official representative of home state medical university we will ask some question with him that how he feels after coming to india after attending our seminars and and we will ask some question about the home state medical university as well so let's start the question so welcome to india atam thank you so how do you feel to visit india this is your first time to india so how do you feel how do you like you have visited too many cities here huh not too much for me okay. like So I tell you one thing: I want to visit whole India. Okay, surely you will visit. You have just come for the short span of time this year, but surely we will meet you next year also. So, did you visit the some of our seminars also? So, how do you feel? What is the intent of the student you are you got? What what feels you got when you see the seminars and all everything? Firstly, for the parents, they took care. They take care about the students. They take care about the family. So that's the thing I like. They need to see in which university they will take their kids. At that time, respect. Okay. And uh, how is your experience with us, with Education Vibes? Uh, we have just uh, we have signed a contract, official contract with your college, and we are officially recruiting the Indian students for you. So, how is your experience? How we are catering students, and after seeing that uh, our presence, Pan India presence, how do you feel, and what is your experience with us? I can say lots of words, but. I will be sure. This is the team of professionals. Okay. And I, I think this will explain it. Thank you. Thank you so much for your kind words, Atom. So let's talk about some Oms about the Oms College. So Oms is a, as everybody know, Oms is one of the largest city in Russia, and it's a heritage city also. So and just I'll just ask you about the academics. How the MBBS process has been done? Then student enter in the first year. What is the process? What are the academics process? What is the process you follow? The, the students who just come, the new students. Well, so uh, firstly, we will talk about application. So the application is quite easy. From the students, I need three things: their passport, their twelve mark sheet, and paper with their signature right. that they are applying to us. After that, we will have two exams: biology, chemistry. After biology, chemistry, we will make a list of students that will apply. On applying, they need to sign a contract between us and between you, okay. and that's it. And what are the supports that uh, you get from the college? Because some of the some colleges did some did not support student too much. So, what kind of support that Oms administration gives to the student, who, international students who want to come? Because it is very much important for the student because students are the age of eighteen and nineteen. Right. So, what supports okay. they supposed to get? I want to say full support because. <laughs> From from the very beginning, from okay. the documents, if something is incorrect, I will just tell you how to do it. Okay. Making a visa, making an invitation, this is really fast, like one two days, and you will get the invitation on arrival. Every time, I don't care if it's morning or late evening, I will be here in the airport. So I must say one thing that education like this, there is separate hostel in Oms. He has their own floor, जहाँ पे हमारे Indian students रहेंगे. and education that will provide you the full support in all the things with the with the collaboration with the oms team also that from the pick and drop services to the post visa visa extension medical insurance everything will be provided by both the parties so what is the exact tuition fee because there is so much confusion in the market that what is the tuition fees of oms because we have got that there is a increase in the fees it is already i think 219 219000 like rubles is the fees But now it has been extended. So, what is the exact fee? You can just tell to our viewers. Two lakh nineteen thousand. Two lakh. Uh, it's ninety-eight thousand. Yeah. Two lakh ninety-eight thousand rubles is the yeah. exact fees of that homes. So, uh, one more thing, Atom, I want to ask you. What are the practical exposure? What are the hospitals which are in collaboration with the homes? Is there how much hospital? Yeah, Give me the number. This is a really interesting question because, as you know, lots of universities in Russia doesn't have clinical bases, uh, but yeah. We are fully medical university, and we have clinical bases around the whole town. Like I think most of the hospitals connect with us. So from the first year, our students go for the clinical base for the practices with real doctors and with the real patients. They will get as much knowledge as they want, and this is the unique experience. 
and uh, there is one um, one question which is very common in the student and the parents as well that can i get cadaver cadaver and a real body practice uh, can it is happen in india just clarify this thing because cadaver is the most important thing that you will practice on a real body and guys anatomy subjects is like this so can they get a real body practice in homes real body practice um, for fifth year for sixth year yeah because from First, the first. Mm. You can the, observe that thing. You can observe. Yeah. yeah, that the practical you can do in the fourth and fifth course, and sixth years. You can do the real body practice. So friends, just like he said, the OMS has the real body practice. Cadaver is there. You can practice on the real body. So, Atan, one last question from my side. That the main campus, the administrative building, is the where the all the admin works has been done. So, what is the distance of the classes in the histology department, biology, and the different department? Because students have to go to the different building for their classes. Five minutes by feet. Five hundred meters. No, that five minutes. Five minutes. Five yeah. minutes by walking, you know. Yeah, because uh, we are located in the center of the city. Uh, our main campus and then in our histology building, anatomy building, it's like five to ten meters. So every building is just five to ten minutes away from the main building where you, uh, where the admin works has been done, and the hostel is approximately twenty minutes. Uh, hostel is twenty to thirty minutes by bus. By bus you can get twenty to thirty minutes from the hostel. If you come from the hostel, you will get in a center of the city, and from there you can access your all the classes. So these are the common questions that has been come from to our end by the students, and uh, we'll wish you all the best and happy safe visit to India. Okay, and thank you very much our viewers and that's all for today thank you